Good morning. Oh, do you, you know, I'm on photo booth, okay? So let's just get real for just a second. When this thing goes, it goes three, two, one, ding. So I never really know when it's starting. So that's probably why I look really weird every time at the beginning of a movie. So happy May Day. It's not like May Day, May Day, someone help me, May Day, May Day. Do you know that there is no relationship between the words May Day, May Day, when someone's needing help, and today, Friday, May Day. I had to look it up because I was curious. So there is no um, association between the two. So May Day. What is the purpose of May Day? May Day back in centering times was where they would make May baskets and hang them on the doors with flowers, ribbons, and they would hang it on the door, ring the doorbell, and run away. And if they opened the door and caught you before you were gone, you had to give them a kiss. Now, nowadays, uh, I don't think a lot of people really want that to happen, except some of you, maybe you might want that to happen, you know, if it's a special girl, special guy, but, you know, hey, the purpose of May Day is just to share the joy with others who typically don't get things in right now with everything going on. What a great day. Make a Take a piece of paper, wrap it up like a cone, staple it shut, glue it shut, put some flowers in it, maybe drop some candy in it, whatever. You can set it on the step and ring the doorbell. You can leave it um, on the doorknob if you want, but what a nice gesture today. If you, And it's a beautiful day to do that, by the way. I got one on my desk at school today. And look at I moved my desk by the window. I'm going to show you. I'm not very good with this technology thing, so I'm sure Alex is all over this. But I moved my desk by the window, and look behind what I did. You see that? There. I took that gray shelf, and I rearranged and put all the tiger stuff on the top and my other stuff there. So I am actually have moved my desk by the window. Yes. Me and my muscles did that. So checking in with you and seeing how things are going. I want to let you know that the last two weeks that I just put on Google Slides is geometry and coordinate plane stuff. So it's looking at graphing points, locating points. It's also looking at some basic geometry stuff. The things that we didn't get to at the end of the year and I want to see, I think you have enough knowledge from 6th grade to 7th graders and 7th graders who are now 8th graders to do those things. Again, I'm encouraging you, if it's frustrating to you, to please try. I've been noticed some, some of you are like almost up to an hour on some skills, and I don't know if it's because you want to get that 100 or master it or you're walking away from it, but I don't want you being frustrated. We talked about that before. So with this stuff again, we're just finishing up with geometry. The lessons go out to May 14th but try to get them done by that Sunday, the 6th, uh, 15th, 16th, oh, excuse me, it goes all the way through to May 15th, my fault, Friday, May 15th, and then, um, you know, try to finish them up by Monday, the 18th, if possible, because we have to store all of that stuff that you're still doing, and some of you who chose paper and pencil to do versus IXL, um, make sure you're getting those packets back to the middle school so that we can record those in power school for you. Um, we've had a lot of things change in the middle school. I'm sure Mr. Banger's been sharing you in your uh, daily announcements, but it does look really nice with the lockers moved and everything. But um, I come to school every day from 8 to noon to rearrange and do things in the room. And I actually have a mess on the floor. Check this out. Let me show you. I am, uh, yeah, I'm cleaning out file cabinets, so there's one section, there's another section, but you can see the room is pretty empty. I did move a few things, see that guys? Got a few new things. Yep, so that's what's been going on in my room. So, anyways, thought I'd check in, see how you're doing. I bet everybody's hair is getting long. The beauty salon's open on Monday. Barber shops open up on Monday. I bet you're all making phone calls and some of you probably have facial hair. I know Mr. Hogue's doing that. Ooh, I don't like facial hair. I prefer not. But anyways, love and miss you all. I'll talk to you soon. I'm going to try and surprise you with something. i got to get myself in gear so that happens. But um, go outside. Have a great weekend. 
and I'll talk to you soon.